line. There's been more violence in the Indonesian province of West Papua with reports that three people have been shot dead near a large gold and copper mine where thousands of workers have been on strike for higher pay. The shootings follow Wednesday's bloody crackdown in the capital, Jayapura, during which Indonesian soldiers reportedly killed nine Papuan protesters. These pictures show soldiers opening fire after a meeting of the Papua People's Congress declared independence from Indonesia. Activists were beaten as security forces dispersed thousands of delegates to the meeting. In Australia, the Greens are calling on the government to suspend military cooperation with Indonesia. We believe that the Australian government should cease its support for the Indonesian military. We also believe that foreign journalists should be allowed in West Papua as a matter of urgency and that the Australian government should provide a fact-finding mission to exactly ascertain what the current situation is in West Papua. The Australian government has described the violence as disproportionate, but the UK's parliamentary human rights group has condemned Indonesia's actions, calling for the immediate release of hundreds of detained West Papuans. Indonesia says the declaration of independence by the Congress was an act of treason.